Hi, I'm going to show you how the error handling can be done in test and there are various methods to do the error handling but uh, this method what I'm going, going to do is I'm going to avoid the errors from the lab view part and uh, just go on with the step even if the error occurs so this is basically ignoring the errors through the sequence steps so if I add a step here with the action step and I already have a, a file used which I will load here so I am loading from the other screen here just hold on This. The VA path is here. So once I load this uh, VA, so this VA is basically a simple uh, VA with uh, a direct error output. When you see here, the error is turn uh, true here, and the error code is one two three four. The error string is error occurred and without any changes if I run this sequence the lab you give some error. okay this is a compilation error so lab you is looking for context yeah this is context all right when I run it again Right, so the lab view has given this error. So this error is basically captured from the lab view module now. So what I wanted now is this, uh, this step, whatever happens, it should ignore the error from this step. So how I can do that is manually, every time whenever the sequence runs, I can click the ignore here and click OK to continue. Or what I can do here is go to this step and clear the errors here so ensure that when you clear this error this still stays there even if you run it again it will still capture the error the error occurred on 234 it's captured so to completely ignore the errors you will need to remove these errors so that when you run it again errors will be skipped and it's basically a done action it's an action step and their status is done that's about it thank you